everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Wayne, here, and today we got something special for y'all because today we are at Little Caesars for they bought back the limited time only pretzel crust pizza. As you know, I think they first released this back in 2014 or 13 around so, and it's been going away, coming back, going away, coming back every once in a while. And now in 2013, they brought back the pretzel crust pizza once again, and apparently everyone's hyped for it. Everyone's been waiting for this. I never tried it, so I can't wait. I'm so excited. This smells absolutely incredible. Total price came out to around $6.99 plus tax, which is 58 cents for a total price of $7.57. So let's see how it tastes. This is the moment you've been waiting for this is little caesar's popular and limited time only pretzel crust pizza you can see oh man doesn't this look so beautiful all the cheese yellow and white with the pepperoni cooked all oh, over oh, oh that was absolutely delicious and the star of the show is the pretzel crust that you can see is all around this pizza right here also compared to the picture the picture looks like it has a lot more salt on the pretzel crust over here it looks like a very minuscule amount of salt huh I wonder how that's gonna taste. But anyways, with that being said, I'm getting hungry, so let's get to tasting. So now that we got the close up out the way, it's time to try the food. So let me grab this pizza slice right here. As you can see, this is the pretzel crust pizza in all its glory. And doesn't it look so beautiful? Although I have to say the bottom of the crust just looks like they're plain, boring pizza crust. But on the top, there's so many things going on. Like there's different kinds of cheese. You can see the colors, yellow and white. You got the pepperoni too. But the star of the show is apparently this pretzel crust. As you can see, oh yes, apparently it's made out of pretzel or something. So it hopefully it tastes good. But before we get started, make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel for more delicious food reviews. And what's that being said, let's just go on in. not bad not bad at all I will say it is very cheesy though but hold on let me get another bite just to make sure hmm like in all honesty the pretzel crust pizza just the pizza itself I'm not talking about the pretzel crust yet there's nothing special about the pizza it just feels like the regular old pizza like the crust itself is not crispy whatsoever it's soft it kind of feels like you're eating a wet cardboard not a great experience the cheese sauce you know the cheese sauce is okay it gives a nice sharp taste it's very cheesy they got the cheese on the top I think they use different kinds of cheese on top so there's different flavors going on it's nice it's melted nicely however I was expecting more of a gooier stretchier pull which you simply do not get from the cheese over here i do like the pepperoni though they're nice and crisp had a good texture and they have a good kick to it overall it's a good pepperoni but at the end of the day for eating it all together you know i just want to say it feels like a glorified cheese stick like that's what it feels like it doesn't really feel like a pizza because there's so much cheese going on on this pizza that it kind of overpowers the pizza filling like you have to be a lover of cheese like you have to love love cheese then this pizza will be for you because this is the cheesiest pizza i have ever seen but at the end of the day it just literally feels like a cheese stick or a glorified cheese stick because bottom itself is basically bread then you got all this cheese on the top and it's basically a cheese stick but then again you're not really here for the rest of the pizza you're here for the pretzel crust so let's try that out let's see how this tastes i'm expecting it tastes like a pretzel mm. you know it's okay but doesn't really have the pretzel taste or flavor like the crust is so it just feels like a more crispier a more harder version of a regular Little Caesars pizza crust. Like pretzel, it doesn't have any of the pretzel flavors or signatures going on. Like if you look at the crust itself, it might kind of look like a pretzel. I mean, it has the color, but you know, I was expecting a lot of salt flakes on here. Cause if you look at the Little Caesars advertisement for the pretzel crust pizza, the crust has a whole bunch of salt flakes. This crust is completely naked. There is no salt flakes whatsoever. It's not even salty. It feels very bland. Just a regular boring crust. It's harder and crispier. Overall, I don't know if Michael Location dropped the ball or something. They didn't make it right or something. I don't know, but it just does not taste like a pretzel. So with that being said, I don't see the hype over this pretzel crust pizza. Like, I know when they announced they were bringing it back, everyone was so hyped about it. They were so happy. They're like, yes, we got the pretzel crust pizza back. But after trying out, it just feels like an ordinary pizza with a harder and crispier crust. Nothing else that's different except it's 
cheesier, I guess. So, with that being said, what would I rate Little Caesar's Pizza on a scale of 1 to 10 for the pretzel crust pizza? I would give this a solid 6.0 because, in all honesty, it literally just feels like eating a regular cheese stick. Just a very cheesy cheese stick. Doesn't really feel like a pizza anymore. And I was hoping so much for that pretzel crust because everyone hyped it up so much. So, I was expecting the pretzel crust to deliver in that absolute flavor explosion, which it simply does not have. It just feels like a regular, ordinary pizza just in a cheese stick form. So with that, I'm gonna give it a 6.0. But with that being said, all I have to say is that, you know, if you wanna try Little Caesar's pretzel crust pizza, I would say, maybe, I guess. I, I'm assuming my location dropped the ball and they didn't make it right. But hopefully your guys' location will make it a lot better. So I guess try it out. It is very cheap, it's like around $7. So it's not bad, you can go try it out and maybe you'll like it. But for me personally, they didn't do a good job with my pizza, so I'm not really a fan of it. But yeah, give it a try and maybe you'll like it. But with that being said, that about ends the video. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to like, comment, share the video with all your friends and family. Also, if you haven't done so, please be sure to subscribe to my channel. You know, I'm a small YouTuber. Any support does mean a lot. And with that being said, that's about it. So catch y'all later.